Hi, welcome to Ty's Country's Kitchen. Today I'm going to show you how to make alkaline coconut milk using a fresh young coconut. And this is currently on Dr. Savy's Nutritional Guide. And the first thing I'm going to do is show you how to open a young coconut. So, I'm going to take my weapon of choice. I'm going to take a chef knife. I'm going to pretty much cut the plastic off. Just off the top of it. Then I'm going to take this knife and scrape some of the husk off of it. Make sure the knife is sharp and be very careful. Until you get to the brown part of the coconut. You can actually see the brown part of it. And these are the certain areas, the veins of it. It's divided into three parts. So then I like to take a cleaver because it has a little bit of weight to it. You just got to come down, but be very careful. You're going to make it like a square or a triangle. Pop it right up. There's the water. And here's the actual flesh, the meat, coconut meat. I'm going to do is put it right in the measuring cup, see how much we got. This is nice, it has about two cups of coconut water. Then I take a spoon and go inside and start scraping the meat out. Let's take a little bit of time. And this brown part is fine, you don't have to worry about that. It's like a little skin but it's not a problem if you want to blend it with the milk now we're going to start making the coconut milk we're going to take the water from the coconut and put it in the blender we're going to take the meat add that what I'm going to do I'm going to blend this first but I also have agave and spring water that's just in case if it's not sweet enough or if it's too thick I'm just going to blend it first. Give it a little taste. See if it's sweet enough. Actually, it's perfect. So we're going to blend it for about a minute to the a little bit more smooth. Now the milk is done. Actually I changed from the blender to the blending cup because it makes it much smoother. You can see how it is now. Now what I'm going to do is take it and put it inside of the nut bag. Also, when you put it in the blending cup, you have least less amount to squeeze out of the nut bag, which you see came out pretty good. So after I strain the milk from the nut bag, the milk is pretty thick. So what I'm going to do is add some water, spring water, about a quarter of a cup at a time, and I'm going to add a little bit of agave. Just a little squirt and blend it and see how it turns out. Now the milk is done. I add about three quarter cups of water and it depends on the size of the coconut. You may have to add less or more water. There it is alkaline coconut milk. It looks delicious. 
and it tastes delicious. So don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thank you for watching. Enjoy.